Do you remember this part? Well, Lindsay teased about a machine that can do this in one hit. This is very important to us, not just as ETG Island, but also as a group. Uh, within weeks of this machine being launched by Nakimura, we sold this machine with this concept into Shannon Precision. My name is Dominic Murphy. I'm the Managing Director of Shannon Precision Engineering. Uh, Shannon Precision was uh, formed back in 1978. We kind of, I suppose, were set up at the start when Shannon was starting to take off. And my dad would have set it up primarily for one or two OEMs that are still customers of ours today. And uh, we've kind of grown into a company that is 40 odd machine tools, 80 odd people, and um, doing lots of kind of high-end manufacturing components for aerospace and, and automotive. Uh, well, this machine has been a big advantage for us. It was our first time purchasing a Nakamura. We went out to multiple companies and we really wanted to get a solution that would give us uh, one part complete every time you press the green button. It's allowed us to be able to control it instead of it being on three machines, we're now getting it off in one hit. We're able to free up some manpower as well, so it's been, it's been a huge addition because it's freed up manpower, but it's also given us all our output through one machine. I'm working here like an uh, operator setter. I'm doing programming on board on the machines if you need it. In the moment, we are making here tension arms. Before we had a problem, we make this in two machines. So the cycling time is, uh, it was too long. Now, with these new machines here, we are making this much quicker and it's much more efficient. So the cycle time is changed a lot. Before, in two machines, uh, we run this part about 40 minutes. Now with one machine, we make this in seven minutes. So for me, it's a big difference because I'm much more efficient and the quality of the part is much better. So before we had the problems with the tips. Uh, now with this machine, we don't change the tips often like we did before. So the machine is much more stable and much more accurate. We talked about automation with ETG from the start on this, but I guess the, the strategy at the time was to make sure that we kind of got the machine in, we landed it, we got the process stable. And we know that we have that now because we have six, six months manufacturing and uh, the machine is a robust machine. It's given us the repeatability. It was the big thing that we wanted from the Nakamura. Obviously, it's a key component to success within automation. So yeah, it's very much part of the, the next steps for us.